Mary-Kate and Ashley Olsen are among the most famous twins in Hollywood. Through their portrayal of Michelle Tanner in Full House, the two became known worldwide. Since they are identical twins, they were able to embody the role together. But that was not the only success Mary-Kate and Ashley celebrated together. On June 13, 1986, David and Jarnett Olsen were gifted with twin daughters. They named the two girls Mary-Kate and Ashley. When her daughters were nine months old, Jarnett Olsen attended an audition with them for the television series Full House. From 1987 on, they were the stars of the series. Together, the two embodied Michelle Tanner. Because of the U.S. Protection Order for Children, a double cast with twins was not unusual. After winning the hearts of viewers in Full House, they followed up with their first feature film to Grandmother's House We Go in 1992. There they appeared in front of the camera for the first time in two roles at the same time. Other movies like It Takes Two also became a real box office hit and the Olsen twins developed into real movie stars outside of the series as well. After the end of Full House in 1995, they remained loyal to show business, making films such as When in Rome and New York Minute during their youth. Since 2000, a beauty line of the two were sold under the brand Mary-Kate and Ashley, real fashion for real girls. Four years later when they came of age, the Olsons became president of the company Dual Star Entertainment Group. Their current annual turnover is estimated at almost 2 billion US dollars. In the same year, Ashley said goodbye to the film industry and both began studying at New York University. Already in the following year, however, they left university. In 2006, Mary-Kate and Ashley founded the high-priced fashion brand The Row, for which they have won several fashion awards. This was followed by more fashion lines and the publication of a few books. In 2008, the two were hit hard by the death of Heath Ledger. Mary Kate was a very close friend with the actor. After finding his body, his housekeeper first contacted the beautiful blonde and only then the police. Mary Kate made her last film appearance in Beastly in 2011. And even then, both siblings were still among the highest earning young actors in Hollywood after Daniel Radcliffe and Miley Cyrus, according to Forbes magazine. To this day, you don't see either of them on the big or small screen. They focus on their work as fashion designers, but their creations have brought them not only good publicity, but also bad. Because their garments are made of real fur, the animal rights organization PETA repeatedly pilloried the two. Nevertheless, the twins still play a very big role in the fashion industry today. Privately, on the other hand, you could quickly lose track of them and their previous partners. Ashley Olsen was involved with cyclist Lance Armstrong in the 2000s, Hangover star Justin Bartha and Canadian director Bennett Miller, among others, in the 2010s. In 2018, it was first reported that she was in a relationship with New York artist Louis Eisner. To this day, the two seem to be happy together and are repeatedly seen together in public. Mary Kate's partners include DreamWorks founder Jeffrey Katzenberg's son David Katzenberg, photographer Dash Snow's brother Maxwell Snow, and New York artist Nate Lauman. Since 2012, she was in a relationship with Olivier Sarkozy, banker and brother of former French president Nicolas Sarkozy. In 2015, the two married. In January 2021, they divorced.